all right so this is going to be a very quick video where i'm going to be showing you how to use a software to start sending out cold emails so over the last couple of weeks i've been sending out thousands of emails and in this video i want to expose you to one of the tools that you can use to start sending out cold emails all by yourself all right so the name of the software is called mail rush so if you want to access mail rush you need to come over to mailrush.io and this is the software that we are going to be making use of to start sending out cold bulk emails so basically mail rush is a cold email marketing software that you can use for cold outreach i mean you can use this tool to start sending out cold bulk emails for yourself and if you're here on this page you're going to be finding a little bit about this tool how the tool works and all like that so in this video most especially i'm going to be walking you through how to set up your email campaign so that you yourself can start sending out cold emails so what you need to do right now is you want to get yourself a free account on the site so i want you to come over to this place where you see try for free and once you click on this button right here you're going to be finding a page where mirror will be needing a bit of information about you so once you've been able to impute all the necessary information needed from you then you should go ahead and create your account of course once your account has been created this is what the mirror dashboard looks like and you can see that this dashboard here tells you that we are making use of a free plan so now that i've been able to cover how to easily create an account on this website let's go ahead and start creating our email campaigns but right before you do that okay constantly i keep on telling people that if you want to start sending out your code emails you need to learn how to warm up your emails okay so email warm-up is very very essential if you want to get your emails landing in the inbox folder of your recipient and one of the super things about mirrors is that mirrors already has an inbuilt email warm-up tool that can help you warm up every of your emails so by clicking on the warm-up icon right here you're going to be seeing how many email warm-up credits you have based on the plan that you are making use of so this is a free plan and you can see the email credit that i have here so based on your plan the email credit you're going to be having is going to be different so now once you've been able to warm up your emails and now you're ready to start sending out cold emails so i want you to click on this icon right here and this is the campaign tab where i need you to follow me closely because sending cold email campaigns with the software is a bit different and technical here is a tutorial video to help you fit you how to start sending your cold emails directly from this tool but don't worry i'm going to be showing you how to do it right here in this video so you need to click on add campaign right here and once you do that you're going to be finding two drop down menus here which means that you can create your campaign directly from using your provided templates which i don't recommend or you can also do your own all by yourself meaning that you can create your own email campaign all by yourself basically from scratch and this is what i recommend and i'll click on from scratch and here you see that we were still provided with your templates but don't worry i'll show you how to edit all of this to your taste so choose any of the provided templates right here that you want to make use of so for me i'll go ahead and um, choose the prospect outreach and now we have already initiated a campaign so now you can see that already we already have a campaign initiated so we have to edit all of this so that we know how our emails are being sent and to who our emails will be sent to so now i want you to look at this okay we're going to be making some edit right now and i want you to learn so that you yourself can do it anytime any day so firstly let's change the name of our email campaign so you want to click on this icon right here on my computer screen i think i should just zoom this a little bit so that you can clearly see the icon so this is the icon you want to click on and once you do that this icon basically would help you change the name of the campaign so i want you to change the name of the campaign to something that you want to make use of so for me i'm going to change it into something more decent now you can see that we already changed the name of the campaign now good so now that we have that changed up already the next icon here this icon is to help us import our email list so you can see that it is quite different from other email marketing softwares from other code email marketing softwares rather this one is basically different for every of the campaigns that you want to send out you have to select the email list you want that campaign to be for so it's different Friend, let's say you have 2000 emails you want to use you want to send out to on mail rush you have to import your email list for every of your campaigns so if the campaign one is for 2000 people and maybe your campaign two is for 10,000, you have to import them campaigns by campaigns so i'm going to click on this icon here and you can see that we have a good looking page here where we can add the desired email list we want to import into this tool for our campaign to get started 
so you can basically do this manually by clicking on add a single contact and i'm here is where you're going to be imputing all of the days manually their email address their um phone number i'm sorry email address the name and every other details that you yourself want to impute and to be sincere i don't re really, really recommend this because it's going to be stressful how can you import sorry how can you impute ten thousand people email addresses manually my god that's really really stressful so you want to go with the bulk email upload so i'll go back to import my email list by uploading a csv file from my computer now i'm going to go ahead and find the file so once i've been able to find it i'm going to select it and i'm also going to import it into the software so now you can see that we already have it imported really really quick so so now you can see that we have the results showing here and which says that we have 34 emails already imported for this campaign right here also if you go back to this place you will see that also we have the 34 contacts showing for this campaign so this icon here is for the analytic tab where you're going to be finding um you know all the data and the result for your campaign this other icon here is for you to edit the email you want to send so on default we have a message provided by this tool so if you want to change this this is something that you can do right here so right here you can basically change out whatever thing you want to change you can add it anything you want to add you can um you know put in your own emails and you can see that this is where you're going to be finding the sender name so let's say you want to change the sender name you can basically edit that right here and also this is where you're going to be finding the sender email address and this other one here is the subject line for this email campaign this is where you're going to be adding your subject line so once done and everything looks good enough you can go ahead and click on save and exit right here so this other icon is to give you access to enjoy more features from the software so i encourage you play around the software yourself to understand how to use it much more better so now that we have everything in the good shape we can go ahead and toggle on this icon to begin our email campaign and once we do that our email campaigns will be live so if if you follow the exact steps that I shared with you, you should have no problem trying to set out your own cold email campaigns using mailrush.io. So if you're finding it difficult to send email campaign to Mirrors, I hope this video helped you out in one way or the other. And finally, to enjoy the best of this tool, Mirrors is apparently different from every other cold email outreach tool that I've been making use of. So which means that there are certain things that you need to do to get the best out of the software such as completing your DNS setup, warming up your email list frequently, validating your emails, email follow up and others. But guys, I need to pay close attention to something. Email warm up is much more important. So please make sure to practice email warm up really, really good. If you do that, I'm telling you that you're going to be having majority of your emails landing in the inbox folder of your recipient. And with Mail Rush, you don't have to use an external tool or an external service for this on mail rush you can also warm up your emails frequently on this tool and also use the same tool to send out your code email so this is the whole process on how you can yourself start sending out code emails using mailrush.io so please take your time to master this tool so also check out the pricing plan okay right here to find a suitable plan for yourself so they basically have different plans here that you can make use of so i recommend you go with the one that that you can afford and you would like to make use of so thank you so much for watching so please if you enjoyed this video smash the like button and if you have your questions always let me know in the comment section below thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my other videos bye